What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K21. My team, you one, guys. Today, we are going over the market. We are going over investments. We are going to go over the best ways to make MT right now. And, um, yeah, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub. To just sub. Sub, comment, like. 50 likes within the first two hours. We're doing a 100,000 MT giveaway today. Also, if you guys want to sell and or buy MT, hit me up on Instagram and or Twitter. I have some stock on Xbox and PS4. Looking to buy more. If you quit the game, if you want to sell your MT, make sure to hit me up. If you want to buy MT, also hit me up. But, yo, um, the title might be MT, right? I'm actually just going to show you some locker codes real quick. Um, real quickly, I just want to show you some locker codes, see what's going on. So, let's see. NBA 2K21 locker codes. And then we will get right into it. I spelled it wrong. I know. Here we go. Okay. So, uh, I don't know, you guys probably entered these in. Most definitely entered these in. But anyways, why isn't this working? There we go. Here's some locker codes, all right? Here we go, these are new. I'm actually gonna type this one in. S5-Super-Packs-Flash. That's a pretty cool one. Um, I'm actually gonna type this one in. We got some pretty cool locker codes, not gonna lie. Um, nothing crazy. I don't know, the locker codes, in my opinion, have been pretty bad. Um, I, I think the whole grind for Donovan Mitchell was worth it. That was pretty cool at all. But uh, honestly, other than that, that's pretty much it. The locker codes have not been good whatsoever. They really haven't. The Donovan Mitchell was really cool, though. But uh, I just typed in my locker code. I'm going to show you what it is. Um, the S5 Super Packs one. Let's see what we got. Oh, there goes that. Wait a second. Where the hell is it? Where is the screen of mine? There we go. Okay. Here we go. Let's see what we get. Uh, we get Flash 3, Flash 4. Oh, Flash 7 all the way in the bottom right. That's where I'm going. Nice drop right there. Definitely not trying to land the middle one. And we're probably going to... Oh, we're, we're going to pass it. <gasps> Please give me the hardened one. I want the hardened one so badly. Or the Giannis one. I'll take the Giannis one. That's a sign. That's a sign. I'll take that. All right. And um, after this locker hole, we are going to get into the market. Hopefully, we can pull a Giannis. That would be phenomenal. I don't even know who else is in this pack. But uh, here we go. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Second video today. Can we pull some heat? nothing oh my goodness all that for that all right okay okay let's get into the market so some things now this is how you make mt in this game right yesterday the market was so crashed because of these packs right what do you want to do it's so simple um wait hold up let me just make sure i know what i'm talking about all right so i've noticed every single card in these packs drop like crazy actually every card in the game dropped like crazy so what did i do well i picked up a ton of malik Sealies. all right I picked up a ton of Dinos. I just kept picking them up. Now, Dino is a player you definitely want to snag. Dino is literally goaded. He's very cheap. He's long. He's a glitch. Um, in my opinion, I, I say pick up as many Dinos as you can for around 5K. I think he goes up. But, I'm mean, this are a little risky. I like to stay with the pink diamonds, all right? This is how I made a lot of MT. I already sold, all, I already sold a lot of them. So, here's what I did. Well, I bought a ton of Malik Sealies, and why is that? Look at his price. Look at his price already. Yesterday, Malik Sealy was at 18,000 MT. Look at it now. He's at 30,000 MT. If you invested at Malik Sealy, at least, he was 18K, like, literally, he was mad expensive. He was literally 18K, 17K, he could have got some for 13, 14, 15. He was dirt cheap yesterday, at least on Xbox. So, I picked up a ton, sold a ton, sold a ton of him um literally crazy pink diamonds yesterday were at an all-time low i picked up a ton of hype pink diamonds for very very cheap ended up selling them for a lot more um this is how i made my mt if you think about it i got them for 18 17 my man oh that's a good one i'm gonna buy that one this desmond mason another player that's probably gonna go up look at that so 10,100, and then that desmond mason is at i just got him for 8900 i could sell him for 10,900. so Gonna make a pretty good profit right there. About a thousand MT profit. This is how you work the market, man. You keep searching players. Forget sniping opals. Forget sniping this. Forget sniping that. 
If you want to make MT quick, man, this is how you're going to do it, man. You're just going to continuously snipe out players. Um, dark matters. This is how you do it. I think pink diamond players are going to be key, especially pink diamond cheapest filter is going to be key with all the part, all the packs and all the action, you know? So uh, put your filters to around 10,500. Just keep refreshing, keep refreshing. It's going to work out. It just all depends. It really just all depends on what pops up, what doesn't pop up. That's how you're going to make MT. That's how I'm going to make MT. That's how I've been making MT. But I think Malik Sealy yesterday was a great investment if you did invest. Any other pink diamonds that are like 30, 40K that dropped to like 20K during a market crash, it's just phenomenal. Um, So I've been stalking out Malik Sealy. i also been stalking out this Carmelo Anthony and also Opal AD. Um, Carmelo Anthony, man, he has no more buyout cards. Oh, wait, I put a maximum buyout. Let's see. I bought him yesterday for 80,000 MT with a diamond contract and a shoe. And look at that. Carmelo Anthony is no longer on the auction for a buyout, which means, I mean, I don't know why he's a buyout in general. This card's incredible. Um, I mean, he has amazing defense. He has Hall of Fame range. He has an amazing three-point shot. So I don't understand why he's this cheap. Personally, I really just don't. So um, yeah, Carmelo Anthony. Why is he so cheap? I don't know. If you guys, if, if you guys got him for cheap, let me know, man. Anything, if you invested in anything yesterday, you're gonna make lots of MT. Uh, another card I realized that was stupid cheap, and I was like, what the hell? Well, who is that guy? It is Galaxy Oval Anthony Davis. Got him for around 210k. Um, I'm actually gonna show you mine right now. Uh, what does he have? Does he have a shoe? He has a diamond contract and a shoe. Got him for 210k. Look at this card. Why was he so cheap? I don't know. I'm not actually a fan of him. I'm going to sell him, and I'm going to sell him, and I'm going to get Opal Giannis instead. I think that's a better move. But yeah, AD's cheap. Got Magic for 110. It's just going to keep rising. The, the cards, everything, guys, you see. Everything is just going to continuously rise, and I think you guys should invest. Um, me, personally, the market is down. This is where 2K gets interesting. This is where 2K gets fun, and how you're going to make MT is literally how I'm telling you right now. You just got to invest. You got to listen to these videos. Pink diamonds are key. Sniping pink diamonds are key. You're going to make 5K, 3K, 2K. It's all going to add up. Um, sniping pink diamonds is probably my favorite method right now, especially just searching up players. Another player that I sniped out, Kevin Durant, pink diamond for 80K. Sold them for 99K. That's a solid 9K profit. You just want to make MT. Did take a little bit to sell. And look at this. Now he's actually a, not even a buyout. There's like none up here. Another card I like focusing on. Um, cards, another card, Zion Williamson. If you did invest, he's up a lot. Um, let's check out his value. Since the new Dark Matter drop, this card is down to 35k. Alright. It's Zion Williamson. I think it's I think I might have to invest in this one. 35k, that's cheap. Obviously, he's not that goaded. It's it's an older card. He's not that good at defense, but it's the fact that it's Zion Williamson, and you should most definitely invest in anything to do with Zion Williamson. Um, so for 35k. This card looks like a pretty good snag, especially if it has some extra badges. Um, but yeah, 35K, and then he goes up to 41K. So you know what? I'm going to buy this card for 35K, and I'm just going to pray he goes up in value. I'm also going to use him. I'm going to try that card out. But yo, that is all we got for this video. hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys have any questions, any investment questions. We're out here for investments. We're out here to make MT. But yo, that's all we got. Have a good one. Peace.